Good evening and welcome to another booth tour from Grey Barn Antiques. Tonight we're going to visit with Burning Sensation Antiques. You'll see on their tags they are vendor UGMO in the upper left hand corner. They are a 20% off items not marked firm vendor. Now if you've not shopped with us before, we do ship many of the smaller items. And if you're local, we do hold the items for you to pick up. I'm going to turn slowly. I just want you to see, that's the thing for hold there, but this is what we've got going on. And we have people that come in once a week or so and pick up. Uh, if you can't get in that fast, we do have, uh, we do let you do PayPal. You can call up and pay on the phone. And of course we do ship. So you can reach us at our phone at 973-786-5555. And this information is in our biography. Our website is graybarnantiques.com. That's gray with the E. Our email is graybarn at graybarnantiques.com. If you're on Facebook, we are Gray Barn Antiques. And Instagram, we are Gray Period Barn. And if you are on any of those other social media sites, it's so much easier if you can just direct message us on there. And if you are able to do screenshots, send us that as well. If not, I do have people that email me with the exact breakdowns and which video it was. And that makes it super easy for me to find the items. So every Wednesday night on our Facebook page, we do a Facebook Live and we do the re That's what you see on your thing with that crazy background green. That's our little doggy. And that is the replay of our Facebook Lives that we do every week at 530 Eastern Standard Time. So Tuesday night we visited with Auntie's Attic and tonight we are visiting with Burning Sensation Antiques. They have two shelves in the case room and then they have three booths in the, the big room. So... First, we'll start with this shelf here. There was a Royal Hubley, there was a Hubley car in here earlier that did sell. So I know some of these vendors, they'll come and they'll watch their, their video and they, Ron was just in today, Burning Sensation. So he's gonna see some things have already moved out that he just brought in. So these brass bells are 20% uh, off. So that'd be $40 for the, the bellhop type bell there. And then the one on the marble base is $32. That little cute teapot there, it's, a, it's got a whistle, it's two pieces, and that's just $12. Isn't that cute? You actually, the back tail there, you, you blow right through his little tailpipe there and it makes that sound. So that's some, these are the older Hummels, you can tell by the bases. The newer ones, they don't have, their, their feet are freestanding, they don't always have that little base. And again, this is Burning Sensation Antiques. You see that vendor code, that UGMO, and he is 20% off. And geez, it's a husband and wife team. It's a cute little silver scone server. 960 for those who don't just grab it off the plate and you want to be a little fancier there you go cute little uncle sam's register back there and he's got one more shelf in this room here and it does not have to be from burning sensation antiques tonight if you see me go past something else from any of our other vendors i will gladly get that information for you as well i anticipate the phone might ring during this i'm going to let it go to voicemail because it is one of our, our customers as well who does purchase through YouTube. So I was gonna give her a call tonight and I haven't given her the call yet because I wanted to do this video first and I just don't want her to think that I've forgotten because I have not. So I will get that call out and this is probably gonna pop up on tomorrow because I think I'm gonna wrap it up after I'm done with this. So 48 becomes, I have no clue. Um, let me see, it becomes 40, so that would be 38 something maybe. And that is a Murano rooster. It does have the official sticker still on there with the bubble base like that. Check out this patented 1899 lamp here. Now you're going to see a lot of oil lamps and stuff in his booth that are fully functioning and that is where we get the Burning Sensation Antiques name. So I'm going to head on over to one of three booths. I did turn all the lights off in the back. You hear me say that all the time. The other night I actually left them on. Tonight I did turn them off. And here is booth number one. The barrel just came in today. That is a whiskey barrel. I do have a, a very interested party in that. So if you are interested in that barrel, I'm going to let the other party know first um, if somebody wants it. I don't want her to miss out on it. She wants to get it possibly for her son. It's just $96. And what's awesome about this, it still has the bourbon whiskey label on there and it has the top and it still has the bands are super tight with the little buttons in really fantastic shape. I think it was 34 and a half inches tall because I did measure that. It does have the little spigot hole in the front there. So if you, I do advise if you plan on going over Niagara Falls to seal up that hole. So 
So you gotta look up and all over in all of our vendors' booths because everybody makes the best use of all of the space that they have. So, and again, I did turn the lights off, so it might be a little dark in some of the corners. This is more of the rustic primitive booth. And the tables like that, Ron does make those. And we've got a lot of great crates in here and metal, wood, the Vitali Brothers. And a lot of these things you will have seen that I have featured on our Facebook Live, our, our, uh, our Instagram and Facebook, because I do post on there daily. There's a nice brass mortar and pestle. And that is just $24. It's not too heavy on the pestle. Or is that the mortar? I always get that backwards. But this, the brass bottom part, does have some serious weight. It has a cute design on it. So that is not moving as you mash your spices or whatever you're, you're mashing up in there. It's not going to move on you. So that's always a nice thing. We've got a bunch of wooden bowls down here. I did go through these the last time. But, you know, if you want any information on them, let me know. I'm going to kind of back up here a touch so we can see what's going on over here. A lot of great cast iron, and it's plain to see a lot of planes over here. And a lot of these still do work. And these are Stanley's, and they are 20% off, so the 30 becomes 24, and the 20s become 16, 25 becomes just 20. You can still get the blades for those. Look at all these great tools in here. And again, we are visiting with Burning Sensation Antiques at Gray Barn of Andover, New Jersey. This is cute. This is older, and there's, it's made, it was made in, I think, Elizabeth? Yes, it's actually, it says Eliz and Jay. So that's for Elizabeth, New Jersey. I, I'm going to date that around the 1920s, early 30s, and that's just $12 for that. I love the colors, the graphics. It does have some scratches, but you know, it's, we're talking about it's almost 100 years old. So, not bad condition at all. These are made by Burning Sensation. And you can read there, that one's, and he's actually got the measurements on that one, so that's $100. You can see the old great spikes on there, and there's a shorter one over there as well. So very unusual. Got some nice green shutters here. That's the pair of them for 40, and they've got wonderful chippy paint on those. We got some great tins here. That's a good little pail here, uh, 1760 for the old pal minnow bucket. That's a good price on that. And his brass and copper is just super shiny. Uh, he just does a really good job on it. That is still vintage. That's a nice hanging scale there with the pan. Wow, $24, and you've got the little pan here. This is this would be such a cute, we're coming up on spring. How cute would that be outside with a little plant in it? What a darling little planter right there. Folk art jug for just $12. That's a decal, it's not painted on there. Lava soap for $28. That is an that's an authentic vintage. It's not, I've made some uh, crates. I've taken old crates, painted them up, and stenciled them. This is not one of those. That's a nice old one stuff down below. I don't really bend that much, so check out this pail. It's got a screen in it. What else do we have on there? It's just $28. It's got the handle. You don't see one like that very often. I, I, I don't know if it was a dairy uh, bucket to strain the milk as you poured it out. The early days of pasteurization where you just took the clumps out. So I was a kid and we went to Germany one of the times, that's West Germany then. Uh, we used to go to our one relative's farm and we would milk the cows and that would be the milk that you would have later on in the day for your chocolate milk and I, you know whatever you wanted to drink it with. We would not drink it straight because it wasn't pasteurized. It was just literally out of the cow, strained, here you go, here's the milk. So we didn't have chocolate milk. We had, I, it wasn't a brand that's here. It was a straw, it was a banana mix. It was banana uh, powder that we put in, and that made the milk tolerable. Because, I mean, you're, you're talking, it was warm. It was utterly fresh. So that was uh, things that stick with you decades later. That's one of them. Well, that's a nice crock down here. It's got the number nine on it, and that's just $21. It was water jug. probably had a lid. It does have the little hole there. So what would that make 
excellent planter. So you don't have to worry about having to drill a hole in it. You've already got one there. I mean, you can put the plant in the planter and, you know, like when they come with the little plastic buckets, it'll fit right in there. And when you're watering it, you don't have to water, worry about the water stagnating in there. Got an instant little drain hole right there. And that's fantastic for just $21. You cannot go wrong for that. Nice old chicken feeders. We sell these all the time. This one's just $16, 36 inches long. Interesting wheel here for just $16. That's really neat. Could do something with that. That'd be a fun project, a light, or just hang it up. And you could, again, great little garden piece. If you hang it, you can hang stuff off of it. And this is a cute, this is an unusual little case that he just brought in as well. It's super clean inside. Look at the age on this. And look at your little tag back here. The MC Lily and Company, military and society goods. So, and this is, there you go, no key, just $40 for that. So I can't quite close it with just the one hand, but it is gray on the outside. It looks very like, You'd find this at like West Point for when they put their formal gloves and, and the hat in the center and the spats and whatever else would have gone in there for the formal attire. Very unusual piece. So since we vis last visited with them, you'll see, you might see some of the same things, but they've been moved from their other booths. Uh, Don, my husband, he loves to work on booths and he kind of came through, he grouped all the, the banks together and he put the stoneware on this shelving because it just pops so much better against the maroon and it kind of actually lends the same color here. So the yellow the yellowware is up here on this just to give it that pop, plus more of the heavier pottery and stoneware is over here. So we are now going to go on over to the other side. I did feature this last night on Facebook Live because what I love about this is $16. The key does work, it does lock up and you can unlock it. The key does work very well. Nice industrial green. And just a little vintage milk pail for 1440. It's two quarts. So now we're gonna walk on over to their other two booths. Now we're passing the Auntie's Attic we did last night on second thought, does all this beautiful furniture. It's a nice painting. I'm surprised this hasn't sold yet. And the price is $52, and there's the measurements. Beautiful little oil, it is signed down there. It's got the texture on it. So, and, here's, and you'll notice from pictures that I've put up in the past of the porcelain plates, they're gone. We had a collector come in today and he bought 14 of the porcelain plates. So if you're thinking about them, too late, they have sold. So we tell you, you only regret what you don't buy. And if you think too long, it goes, it does sell. So there was the coffee table here. That one has sold. This one got pulled back out again. And this is a, little, a smaller size. It's made from an old stove. I did not see this today. This just came in recently. Old coffee box for just $20. And it's got the Mexican siesta, the uh, sombrero gentleman and senorita here with the, it's a decal. So that's about, that kind of stylization with that would be the 1930s, early 1940s. That was a very popular uh, design on a lot of the pottery and homeware kind of stuff. The Southwestern flair. And again, the copper is old, but it has been polished beautifully. This is an interesting little piece here for 44. Tilting coffee pot. Okay, so you would, oh yeah, so you can just tilt it without having to lift it. See how nicely that does that? So you don't have to pick that up. And it's got the little sterno burner underneath there. A lot of great pots and pans. They have like a cast iron handle and then the copper there. And this is a set of four. So I'm gonna sell this, here we go. So it's recently been reduced from 300 to 250 and then 20% off on that. So it's $200 for all four of those old copper pots. And these little guys are just $16 each. They do have the guts inside of them, the little percolators with the wood handles. It's a cute little black lattice type shelf here. And that's just $36. This just came in, I did feature this the other day on our Instagram and Facebook page. And it does work, it has newer parts inside of it. You're gonna take the 20% off of the 175. So you do have all the workings on that one. A little tin rooster for just 24. This is an unusual little shelf. It's got a screen up there. And it's got the hooks there, and that is $20. Some great artwork, too. He's always got great artwork coming in. 
I should say they. This just came in today. It's $32. It's a vintage brass wood book with the rest. So you have it. It's mount, mounted on this wood, and it does have the, you can put it to different heights, whatever angles, whatever angle you might need it at. So it does sit up a little bit if you need it to. And here's where we get into all the lamps that have been restored. I did purchase the cherub lamp that he brought in that was converted from gas. This is amazing. Look at this piece here. 120. Just, I mean, look how dainty this is. And then you've got this gorgeous bubble like uh, milk glass with a cranberry tint to it. And it goes down to, to like a shell pink. Just, just stunning. Absolutely beautiful. And again, please do not re hesitate to reach out to us even just to ask a question, any measurements, prices, we will gladly get that for you. And again, we are visiting with Burning Sensation Antiques, vendor code UGMO, and you are taking 20% off. So 15 does become 12. And if I don't focus on something and you want more information on it, please just let me know. We will gladly get that for you. And then here's another hanging scale. This one's got the, this is a milk scale. And that one is 90 and then the 20% off. So $72, I think. And then the creepy baby. I know fault of its own. It, I just say creepy because I've turned off the lights and gone through with the big black light. And there's a slight glow to the picture. So that kind of, you know, spooked me a little bit. Not what you want to see, a glowing baby. That's an unusual basket, and it has the little green pieces on it there, and that's fourteen dollars. So it's in those little wire folding up baskets. The cute little piece of aluminum there. Another beautiful light, and that one's sixty-four dollars. What is this? Well, it's two hundred now, one hundred, and take twenty percent off, so that becomes eighty. I'd imagine this had a lid. It is right hot. What does that say for hot chocolate? And there you go. Look at that. That is a gorgeous piece of stoneware. It's a, and it's got this gorgeous cobalt glaze, and it is glazed throughout. So it does have, well, that's just like paint or something on there. It's just a beautiful piece. Some more copper, some awesome heavy cast iron, metal pieces, more copper, pewter. A lot of great stuff in here. Nice old cocktail shaker. More tilting teapots and coffee pots. Kitchen tools. This is an unusual trivet. Oh, it's marine. $12. Oh, yeah, look at that. Marine land. Very cool. Copyright metal crafter. Very neat. Look at this one. I know a lot of people that love eagles, and they love the, um, the eagles that you hang up above your door and that. This one's really nice. This is a really cute one for just $12. Uh, $16, I'm sure, sorry, 20 and then 20% 20, uh, 20 off becomes 16 That's a really nice, because what's cool about this, look, with the little peg hooks, you can actually just stand that one up. Look how it gets this brass, just amazing. The shelf, I know Don's trying to figure that out. And we did check out these bird cages a few weeks ago. I believe they're both usable and the prices on them are fantastic. For Astoria Coin in the Amber. A lot of great bottles. We have lots of great bottles in the shop. Right? A lot of great stuff, period, in the shop. <laughs> and again, you're taking 20% off on those prices that you see that do not say firm. I was looking at this earlier. Nice piece of smoothed on the inside. It's got the smooth bevel piece, and that's uh, 12 inches tall, and that is $32. And I see that there's a sticker on the bottom of it. It's an amber glass colored piece. It's just got this beautiful etching a shell bottle for just 12. Smooth in here, so I don't think it had a stopper in it. Here's another taller one for 16. Uh, with the one hand, I really don't want to pick those up and try to look at the bottom to see what the if they have uh, smooth pontils or not. Kula. It's very interesting. It's a brown bottle. It's got this iridescence to it. And that is just $12. Very cool. Nice lidded uh, stoneware. 
two gallon water cooler for 60. It's got the marks there. Unusual nesting hens with their heads painted. This one's like actually dyed into it, and that's 16. There's some things on the bottom. Nice crock for 40. And he did bring in another table. It's a little different from the one that just sold this past Sunday. The one from this past Sunday had a lot of industrial pieces on it still. It was a different type of cart. And this one is 450 also, so 360. And he has some measurements on it there. So he does make these. So he's getting a little tired right now because of all the, the work. So you can see this one doesn't have all the pieces like the other one did that just sold out of here. It's still fantastic though. And this one might be a little bit, I don't think it's as heavy. So it's pretty cool. He just does beautiful jobs. He, job. he actually made this shelf as well. And all the items on it, of course, are for sale, as is the shelf. Don't have the measurements here. I have measured it in the past. Neat bottle ship for just $16. That mirror just came in. I cannot see the price tag from here, but you can. So you take the 20% off of that. Some great old photos and prints and lithographs. These are working for oil lamps. So if you, for your ballroom, you need those if you're planning on entertaining. Gorgeous candle. Look at the size of this candelabra. Wow, $38 and then 20% off of that. And some more artwork. That looks like a Bessie Goodman one. I can't see without my glasses. That one definitely is. Just going on the buttons are 12 a jar because I do have people that collect the buttons in the jars like that. It's a nice 22 firm and 25 firm for the syrup dispensers. The cheese boxes are 18 and then 20% off, so they'd be 14.40. Great clocks come in. This copper piece here that's 175 and then 20% off. Huh, very cool. And again, you are visiting with Burning Sensation Antiques because he specializes in, but not limited to, all things lighting. So you got some great pictures, and again, it's 20% off. This is 16. I think there was a hairline. I'm not sure. I know there was some damage on it somewhere. That's why it's priced so well. It's an unusual little smooth bottom. But what a cute little piece of blue glass that is for just 640. I love the, how that light catches the crystal. Great amount of little teapots down here. And again, 20% off. And some pottery, more furniture. So other than the large shelves in his booth and the wall, these two wall shelves, I think every piece of furniture is for sale in here, including this chest, which currently is housing a lot of little cookbooks and large cookbooks. So if you're looking for those, we have them here and a few of the other bo uh, booths as well. This has been here for a bit. So 24 for the black fur muff and change purse. And you have a couple more things up here. And we're gonna spin, there's a little cradle up there. And again, take the 20% off. So 40 would become 32. Ah, that's a lot louder than I expected. Sorry if I startled anybody. And this is one that you would like hang over your door. I'm going to walk on back up to the front. That just came in as well. This really cool, it's like a metal, uh, the plastic coating on it. And she's got the measurements on it. Uh, so $52, so that just came in. It does have the measurements and that's from Redreamable. So if this really amazing shabby chic basket has caught your eyes make sure you just say it's the basket from redreamable so i'm going to walk on back up go over to our blackboard again and get you that information i'm deliberately not raising this because there's a mirror there and i really don't feel like seeing myself walking around with a selfie stick and again that was with burning sensation and here is all of our information on how to reach out to us and you can also find that on our biography page and these are our Coyer candles which are all soy with a lead-free wick so I'm in the general store section right now
So I hope you have a lovely evening and we hope to see you again soon. Thank you.